On Tuesday, we found out that the Eurozone's GDP was down by 3.6% and employment down by 0.2% in the first quarter of 2020. And Australia's consumer sentiment rebounded to pre-pandemic levels. Welcome to the Tickmill Update. I'm Kiana Danielle, the founder of the Invest Diva movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your forex trading friends. On Wednesday, we'll be eyeing the key economic data out of the U.S., including its inflation rate, as well as the all-important FOMC rate decision. Today, I'm looking at the dollar-yen pair, which is completing its pullback towards the upper band of the daily Ichimoku cloud after breaking above it last week. As of Wednesday's early Asian session, the pair continued to test a 38% from Nashi retracement level of 107.64. Depending on the U.S. economic data on Wednesday, we could see a relief, especially since the future cloud appears to turn slightly bullish. The next resistance level is set at 109.20. Do you think the bears will give up their sentiment this week? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.